to my YouTube channel at the health food store over there. I'm on Cascade Road, but I'm right at the beginning of Cascade Road, so that's 28th Street right there. And then Cascade Road it goes this way, so I'm at the corner of 28th and Cascade. And I had to pick up my medicine here at this pharmacy, Walgreens, and there's a bus stop here. So the bus is always delayed so that it looks like I'm going to get drugs from someone or going to their house or something. So every time I'm in 28th and Cascade, I stand here forever waiting for the bus. <clears throat> and so that's what I'm doing, standing at a bus stop. So I got out here at 3.02 and the bus doesn't come till 3.23 or 3.24, or, yeah. It'll be here in a minute. doing stuff on my Facebook to um, block, I think, other people from my family or anybody seeing it. So, as soon as I started putting stuff on YouTube, he could see what I was wearing. He knew it was me that was out here. Somebody just tried to get me to put my um, new debit card number on my cell phone and right before I got here. I wouldn't do it, and then I saw the girl that was working at the counter at this Walgreens that was behind the counter smelling like crack or meth or whatever that is that they all smoke. And um, it was online. They wanted me to put it on a, a different site so that I would put, they wanted me to scan my card because they could see my cell phone. They didn't get my new debit card numbers. I'm the one with the new debit card. I just got it. I didn't put it in my phone yet. My other card got stolen, so actually at the Cascade Myers it got stolen. I'm in Forest Hills, is what they would call this, I guess, under your location on your cell phone. But on a sign it says Cascade, so it's so that they can, you know, try to do whatever they're doing to me because they stole my car. The street's called United Bank. I don't know what that bank is. Then there's one over there called Independent Bank. Then there's like a, a car wash there. And then the Harvest Health Food Store there. Like the Cascades got a little area. It's called Foling Dollar Tree, which I'm assuming Foling is like football and bowling mixed, which would be just an ego. Because it says fuck off. Ho. Because those are the only words they know. Like he wasn't educated at Muskegon like I was. He didn't go to Muskegon. So that's why his education only has those words involved in it. And that's why he talks like that. I'm not the one that drank. He is. Um, he's the one that gets drunk and acts like a moron. That's not me. So, um, right now I'm here on 28th the Cascade at the corner. This is where I had an eye appointment Tuesday scheduled. And on Monday they called me and said that they weren't going to be in because the doctor was sick for another month at the RX Optical on Cascade and 28th. And I'm assuming that somebody went in there for my appointment on Tuesday because it's in my calendar on my phone. And they want me to come in next month, a whole month away. My appointment was Tuesday, but they want me to come in another whole month away. And I need to get glasses. I have contacts in. So somebody went and ordered some glasses under my shit, and they were going to go have, make it look like I was picking them up. I wasn't the one at that appointment. I'm right here. That's why I come here, because this is where I have to pick up all my medicine, because if I don't, and I transfer it to a Walgreens that's near me, um, they mess with it so that I'll come here, because he made it look like I was coming here to his house. So they could steal my car and drive it to that location. There was actually somebody in Cascade going around the block and jumping in my car, pretending that was me at the, house, the condo that I used to live in, in Cascade. It's a um, Lincoln MKZ 2015. It's black. It's stolen. License plate has Dairy Queen DQ 5055. My number's five. My softball jersey's five. My number's been five. 
that I've always had on my Varsity Jackass 5. So they were making it look like I was still at that condo, that I still lived there. And there's a different girl there and they had two rooms and one went straight down the hallway like this one and one went off to the corner but at the same, like the end of the hallway. So there was one to the right off to a corner and one straight back. So he was making it look like he was coming in the room with me and going to the one straight back with her in a room. So, fuck you too. I gotta do this shit, bigger of it makes me. See what I'm saying? Oh yeah, Justin played football at Grand Valley. And um, he was at the bowling alley when I called and said that they just started me on fire, me and my son. They set the house on fire while I was in it and tried to set me on fire. Then they made the Rihanna song about it, how they set me on fire. And then he's got bowling right there, which is like, fuck off, bowling. Because when I called, I was like, me and Travis are standing outside and the house is on fire. Can you come? No, I'm bowling. You sure? You probably said it. Then they had the audacity to think I was going to call the fucking fire department. I was like, no, I you guys just set that fire and you were already trying to frame me the whole time I was living in this motherfucking shithole. I'm just happy I'm outside because this fucking thing is going to cave in anyways because it's condemned. Fuck you give a fuck if it's even on fire. I don't give a fuck if it's on fire. It ain't mine. None of the shit's in it's mine. Tried to set me on fire. Why would I give a fuck if, the, if they come put it out or not? I'm not using my phone, I'm not calling them, I don't want to be involved in your fucking scheme. See this? Set and spin. So by the way, Justin Ego is my ex-boyfriend. Also. Who by the way, since he's known me, has called me a hoe. I'm the hoe. He would call me while he was out at the bar drunk. Driving. Home. You fucking hoe! Are you there? I was still at home. I never even left the house. I was actually studying. I was such a hoe that, like, there must have been people coming over while I was studying. Like I said, I mean, you guys keep, keep listening. You look like morons. Like, I can't figure out, like, if you guys have, like, an education or just completely never got one here. 